WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. We have the Dow Industrials trading uh, down 90. NASDAQ is off 98. S&Ps are off down 24. Gold. Gold contract down $7.40. Trading at 1637 an ounce. We have silver flat. $19.14 an ounce. Light sweet crude down a buck 57. $86.33 a barrel. Notes and bonds. The 10-year note trading uh, down 14 ticks. 110.18. The 30-year down 27 at 120.12 in King Dollar. King Dollar is up 786 ticks. Trading 111.539. The euro is at 98. The yen is out here at a price point of 148.63. And the British pound is 114 to 1 US dollar. Now, it's going to get a little tricky here this week. And the reason being, folks, okay, is that Friday, okay, had a heck of a run, no doubt. But the bottom line is that you had a monster contraction of volume. So that tells me we're going south. Now, that being said, uh, bottom line, you can see that, you know, you're backing down. Um, slightly, you're down at the spies down 260. Uh, you only you have 52 million shares, so now you're backing down with light volume. Uh, the NDX 100, we take a look at the NDX, and of course we have the Fed on Wednesday, and that's going to rule everything. You have the the Qs. Bottom line, that's an inside day down 330, 37 million shares. Now that's light volume, but now we're going to go to the dollar. So the dollar, folks, I suspect what it's looking like in the dollar, man, is that this thing is gonna go after its trend line. This is a great uh, man, Mr. Bud Rolfs, rest in peace. Uh, bottom line is that this trend line now is hitting, let me make this again one more time. What happens when you break a trend even with conviction, which we did, the markets, they love to go back up and test the underside of the trend line. And the price always changes on the trend line because it depends what day it is because you know the longer it gets extended out the further that the price could go in this particular case we're looking at a one i think it's to 112 550 so it's about a thousand ticks from where we are right now okay here we go got it okay so we're talking 112 480 so you're 900 ticks away from it but it looks to me like Coming right into the Fed to speak, that's what we're going to get right up to that level. If we get up to that level, you're going to see this market back down. If it backs, if it, so this is cool. If it backs down today with light volume, we back down tomorrow with light volume, guess what? Whatever this Fed says, it would be saying we go topside. If we come down with heavy volume, different ball game, man. Total different ball game. Stay right there, folks. We'll come right back.